we were walking and walking through the mountains. In the desert. Uh -huh. And um, the man, he told us to take our shoes off because it was a lot of rocks. And he said, I don't want no noise because the dogs are very, very good to detect every noise. Oh. And he said, I'm going to whistle and you're going to duck. And it was a point where he whistled. You know, we went out on our stomachs and we stayed there. Oh, my God, I can see ants, <laughs> big ants crawling. And I was so scared. And, and he said, when the Border Patrol change shifts, yes. You know, you're going to run. Mm -hmm. I remember it was a torture in those rocks without shoes. So I, we ran as fast as we could. And then he said, you're going to walk through that bridge. I'm going to walk behind you. And you're going to give me the money there. And then from there, you're on your own. What, uh, what kinds of jobs did you have since first arriving in the country? We were gardeners. And we were cleaning offices. I remember the offices. You remember that? <laughs> we had the night shift cleaning. Mm -hmm. That's why, you know, we had to take you, you and your brother. I didn't have a babysitter. I have memories of running into everyone's office and eating candy from their candy dishes. Mm -hmm. I remember being with my brother in our pajamas with the little plastic right. feet. <laughs> and I also remember you would always buy us a cup of noodle from the vending machine, right, right like a, a snack, and then, and then put us to bed on people's office couches. And then you'd carry us to the car when you guys were done cleaning the offices. Mm -hmm. I remember that. Did they ever know? Did your bosses ever know that you, you took your kids? No, I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> Is there anything that you've never told me but want to tell me now? When we first came here, we went through a lot of things like not eating. Mm. I guess for six months, your father lost his job, and mm. but we never told you that. I do remember a lot of beans, bean tacos. <laughs> <laughs> but if, when you ask us why, why the same thing, remember? Yeah. yeah. I, I didn't want to tell you why. Yeah. Um, if you could do everything again, would you raise me differently? I would dedicate more time, I guess. You know, I was so busy doing, going to school, too, that I guess I neglected you a little bit. <laughs> no, for me, watching you go to school with two kids and trying to make ends meet, that was the biggest inspiration for me to finish college. I thought there's, there's nothing that could stand in my way that didn't stand in yours more. So... It's the most important thing for me, uh, having gone to college, and I feel like anything I do from here on out is okay because I've already achieved my dream. Everything else is icing on the cake.